Tulians, welcome back to the channel. Um, as usual, I'd like to thank all my subscribers and my new subscribers. Um, I'd like to thank everyone for all their comments. Um, also, like I mentioned in previous videos, I'm trying to get to 500 subscribers so I can get the community tab to engage with you all a bit more. You can um, leave more comments to more questions um, and I can answer things a little bit easier with that tab. So. I need to get 500 subscribers so if you could all um, subscribe that'd be much appreciated today we're gonna have a look at the little wearer ratchet and stubby i was a little bit unsure whether to get this um i've seen the price it's like 34 quid um i've seen the backo model for 10 pounds without this little magazine bit set so i think only time will tell what i or whether i think this is worth worth the money um, so what I'm going to do guys I'll bring you a bit closer we'll open it up see what you get in there um, not expecting too much just the ratchet and stubby in there but um, I'll bring you a bit closer we'll have a little look guys hi guys so here we have it the little wearer stubby so in the box you get obviously the wearer stubby with your little mag loader on the top get a sticker as always, brilliant quality boxes from Wearer. Um, so there's the handle itself. You've got obviously your left and right and your fixed position there. Just flicks over. You've got your little magazine there. Obviously they couldn't do the same pop out as they do with the long one because of the size of it. So compare size wise, it is tiny really impressed with how they've done that and um, they've they've really done well popping back um i'm gonna put it to use um as soon as i've done the video i'm gonna get cracking using it um one thing i wasn't too sure about is um whether or not you could get a good hold on the screw well ratcheting because you need that extra pressure Instead of like a normal um, stubby screwdriver, but I don't think that'll be an issue. Just pops in there, and obviously that's flexible, so I don't think you're going to get any breakage on it. You know, if you're dropping it or anything like that. But it's a very weighty little product, so gives you quite a bit of confidence in the actual product itself. You've got the lock-in one there, so you can just use it as a normal stubby. Like you say, it's on a little Constantine effect going around there, I think. Is that the right word? But it's all very, um, very well built. Very, you know, when you put it into whichever gear, you know, tighten or loosen. It seems um, very positive. And obviously you've got your magnetic holder in there. Um, and your normal wearer quality, which is brilliant. Um, so that's just a little look around. I am going to be doing a follow-up video on this, guys, um, as I do with all the tools after a couple of weeks of usage. I'll just come back to them and just give you my final reviews. These are just like little look-overs. If you were thinking again in yourself, you can just have a look, see what um, you, you're actually paying or what you're getting, because it's all very nice to have a look at pictures. But um, if you did want to think about purchasing that, you can watch a video. Um, thank you for watching guys. Thanks for subscribing. Any comments, please leave them. Um, I am going to get around to doing more videos. It's been a bit of a busy uh, week and a half. I was working away for the first part of last week. So, oh no, that was the week before last. First part of last week. So thanks guys. Um, and I will send out some more videos soon.